on Shea Bear 1000 here. Got some traffic going by, but we're doing something new that's pretty old. It's new to us, but it's been around for a long time. As you can tell from the title, we're going geocaching. This is our first geocaching trip. So we're going to go try to find some geocaches. We'll be back with you. I got coordinates brought up for the first one, so stay tuned. Okay guys, we found the first geocache. This is so cool. Monkey's coming. I crawl. There's a path right there. I crawled through that thicket. And I was going down in about the middle and she goes, is that it over by the tree? And there it is right there. So I'm gonna let her do her do her video thing and then we'll bring it up here and we'll open it up. I guess I'm gonna get this one monkey's gonna get the next one. Right. Yeah. Wow, this is cool that yeah. we found this. Yeah. This is really cool. Yeah. And it's fun because you gotta find them. Right. Really neat. Oh wow, look at that. It was found February of this year, uh -huh. 16th. Oh, wow. So, last month. Oh, that's cool. And we found it. Yep, and we found it. So, a little piece of paper there. There's some matches. Oh, cool. And here in a minute, I'll read to you about it. These matches are designated, as, designed especially for damp climates, but they will not light when wet or after long exposure. So that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. An old match book. Yeah. Next time Neat. we'll bring stuff in, we'll leave. Yeah, for other I'd like people. to get some um, stickers uh, and put them in there. So that's cool. Yeah, yeah, our stickers. Yeah. So let's go with. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and shut mine off. Yep. And I'm going to sign this and then I'll read about. There's a. Uh, there's a story about this. This is historical here, so. Okay. It says, congrats to Bulldog Love for FTF. For those of you that don't know, that means first to find. So that was who was the first one to find this. Uh -huh. um, it says, this is our first obscure history series. Hopefully everyone will enjoy learning about Citrus County history that didn't make the mainstream history books. You are seeking our very first lock and lock. We put a pen in, but it's always good, always a good idea to have one handy, which we brought. <coughs> Pens don't last forever in Florida heat. No. So, when you find this cache located on the Whitlacoochee State Trail, you will be standing at the very place that forever changed Citrus County. Really? This spot right here. Originally, the rail line was to pass through this area, which is now a ghost town. Arlington. This is called Arlington. You're standing in a ghost town. Oh, wow. Hence the old bricks. Mm-hmm. And the old bricks. Yeah, I noticed these bricks. Okay. Oh, wow. Um, Isn't that cool? And continue along this barely visible grade into what is now the Whitlacoochee State Forest and near the county seat, Manfield. That's where the cemetery is. Right. Remember, we yep. went there and we did the ghost thing? There. Yep. Yep. We were there, yeah, we did a video on That's it. That's where this ran to. Oh, cool. After the forced relocation of the county seat to Tompkinsville, now known as Inverness, so mm -hmm. this used to be called Tom Tom Tompkinsville. Tompkinsville. Yeah. And the discovery of phosphate in Floral City, which is just a few miles right. down the road from us. Uh, the rail line the rail line was redirected to the path which is now the Withlacoochee State Trail, which is right, right back trail there. That we've been they on probably that we showed you. Yeah. Okay. That's so, very interesting. The grade was already done. Rock was already poured. 
the rail gate the rail grade that was never a rail line is still visible in the Withlacoochee State Forest as Trail 9 to this day you can still find granite along this trail the rerouting of the rail line caused towns along the planned route to disappear some that still show on some maps include Orleans and Landrum the Citrus County we know today would be quite a different place had the change not occurred. Yet to this day, this place remains unmarked until now. So no one until so Florida Terra Blazer. Really? <laughs> well, <laughs> I didn't see him here. No. No. Uh -uh. <laughs> so this there. is really cool. <laughs> okay. And it's fun. You can actually still see the grade on Google Maps and follow it right over top a Australian sounding restaurant and into the forest. Australian sounding restaurant. What one would that be? Australian? Australian sounding restaurant. So anyway, that's our first one. I'm gonna go ahead and log it and I'm gonna put found it. See, it'll say found it or DNF. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Okay, mm -hmm. the DNF means did not find. So we're gonna put found it. Okay. Cool. Yeah. All right, guys. We're okay. going to drop him off and yeah. we're going to go on to the next on. one. Yeah. And we're going to adventure. And the next one's not that far from the house, right? No, it's at the park at the end of the road. Oh. So I took we'll my there. viewers up there on the John Deere one day. Yeah. John Deere John Deere vlogging. Check out that video. Yeah. I strapped a camera. That's uh -huh. before we had any action cams or GoPros. I strapped that big old camera on the hood of the tractor. Right remember mm -hmm. and i put it on sponges so it wouldn't vibrate as much right so. all right guys on to number two yep okay so we're at number two yep we have found it monkey's gonna open this one and I'll show you, she's showing hers right now. I'll show you. Pretty cool. And I'll let him show you. Show. And then she'll get it out. That's it right there. Pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah, hard and it, 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 it's amazing because, you know, we come here. <laughs> we never realized all this. Okay, it's so cool. Monkey's gonna get that out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get it out. Lots of caterpillars. And then I'll read about this one. Here we go. See? Cool beans. Can you hold that camera for me? Okay, we're going to open this up. It's a piece of paper stuck in the very bottom of it. It won't come out. Ah! I can't get it out. I need it. Maybe my keys or something might go in there? No. Mm -mm. I got it. There okay. we go. And someone didn't put it back in the bag. Or it got out of the bag somehow. Okay, so here's your little letter. And it was done on 11, I think that's 10, I don't have my glasses on, 10 or 16. Uh, 12, 27, 20 was the last one. Oh, on the bottom? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. And it looks like, like two people have done this, found this one. So that's pretty cool. That's this was This one was placed here in 2012. Yeah? Yes. It was placed here in 2012. Mm-hmm. Um, let me see here. The uh, last person that logged it, though, um, it was found January 11th of this year. So let's read the description. Mm -hmm. An easy cache find in a nice park. This is my first hide. You are looking for a matchstick container. That's what that is. Mm -hmm. 
at a pleasant little park I found while geocaching in the area. So they found this place while they were nah. looking for other stuff. Congratulations to Cruiser 352 for a fast FTF. First hmm. to find. That's pretty cool. And that was 2012. Wow. Okay. So we're gonna write our I'm gonna write our things on here and yeah. we'll get it put back in there. Okay. Cool beans. <laughs> okay guys. We are at the next one. This is number three. This one took a while. It's right underneath them palm leaves. And that was that was one of the clues. Was Florida style. There it is right there. Right. Right there. Can you see it? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead. I won't get this out of here. It's supposed to have been a one gallon thing, but uh this one was put here i'm, I'm not going to open it until she gets back she had to change her battery this one was put here in 2005 so as soon as she gets back we're going to open this up and check it out okay some monkeys back my camera's steaming up mm -hmm. oh, i got stuff all over my lens okay so let's open this up Cool, let's see what we got. Got our little paper to mm -hmm. sign in on. Mm -hmm. There's also Aw, isn't that cute? It's a little keychain. Little keychain. Now we leave this stuff here, but you can add stuff and yeah. a little domino. Yeah, cool. Back of the key keychain says this is Vinny the Vampire. I am a cash buddy. Please log me on www.geocache.com and move me to another cache. Oh, so we could take it and move them. Yeah, but um, I don't know how to do that yet. <laughs> well, the next one we go to, you just put him in there. No, because then there, but you have to change it though. Oh, on the website. Yeah, or people oh. be looking here for days and not find it, and right. we moved it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> going to leave it here because... Yeah. All right. Okay, so this was last found. Okay, see, it was logged in as it was found 32221, and that's what we got here. So, all right. So we're going, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to, I'm going to sign our names on here. Yeah. We're going to put this back in here and I'm going to log it in so they know we found it. Right. So this was just found five days ago. Yeah. So, all right guys, and then we're going to go on to number four. And each time you get a smiley face of where you found them. Yeah, on your app. On the app. Yeah. So That's this will cool. be the third smiley face. Yeah. All right. So, so I'm going to write our names and then we'll go to the next one. Okay. Okay, guys. Here's find number four right here. So let's go ahead and pull this out. You want to do this one? I can do it. Okay. I'm going to let Monkey do this one, and I'll get her camera. I can turn it off. Okay. You got to go around me. Okay, so monkey's gonna get this one out here. There we go. Little bottle. Okay, let's see what's in it. Looks like I got a little water in here, but that's okay. And that's what's in there. Okay, there's our thing. Yeah, this is your paper. And it has a little plastic thing around it. out so you guys can see it. Now I'll read on this one. Oh. What is no one has found this by this piece of paper? Well that's probably just new paper because it says it was found 227 of 21. Oh yeah? Yeah. Well, this was put here in 2005. Uh-huh. So it's probably just a new paper. Oh okay. You are this one is called um 
Brogdon Troll. Because you know trolls live under bridges, so right. that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's neat. And the description was, you are seeking a magnetic key holder, an interesting, an interesting spot on the way to Potts Preserve. So. Very cool. Cool. All right. Awesome. So I'm going to sign these out, sign us, sign it for us, and, and you want to do, you want to do more? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Of course. Yeah. Okay. So she's not done yet. We'll go do some more. Okay, guys. Monkey found this one. This is our fifth one. Yep. Here we are. We found it. We are in Whispering Pines Park, and here it is, right there. <clears throat> Oh, this is taped. Oh, cool. With yeah. camouflage duct tape. Oh, neat. Okay, so yeah. let me get behind the sun here. All right. Let me show you this. And here it is. Cool. That's cool. Open this up. See what kind of goodies are in here. There's our log book. Ah, cute. One of those things for McDonald's or Burger King or something. That's cute. A little toy. Ah. A little toy. <laughs> this one's chock full of stuff. Yeah. There's my fluffy. Oh shit. Ah, minion. I thought it was a monkey. <laughs> when you said that. But a minion. A minion. We also have a lion. We have a lion. Mm -hmm. We also have uh, more Mickey Mouse stickers. These are put in, you can take one. And we also have another domino and two nickels. Cool. Which we will not take the nickels. No. I don't have Is any Is there change. an old year on them or something? No. No? Okay. So, that's pretty cool. Yeah. We're going to put these in here. Very neat. This one had the most in them. Yeah. Yeah. Else. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to sign our paper for us, mm -hmm. and I'm going to log in, and I'll kick you guys back on. Yep, this is what, number six? Yep. It was stuffed up under there. And there you go. It's called a micro. <laughs> micro. Okay. Yep. So it's real tiny. Yep. Let's unscrew this. Can you, can you get that? Let me get my glasses on here. Let me sure. That's cool. We were so close. And there you go. And there it is. Wow. That's I don't neat. usually like to stick my fingers up in there, but I thought, man, it keeps pinging me right here. Yeah. We were on top of it. The last it. one was here last month, February. Yep. Ah, oh, neat. Look at so, all the people that found it. Yeah, this really one. Cool. Let me see if I can get the information. Okay. The uh, the description <coughs> is just a sim simple traditional cache. The location provides for easy access and convenient parking adjacent to the high. So it should be a park and grab. Okay, and the hint is coded. Yeah. The hint is coded. Wow. 
So, but I'll read to you. I figured out what it says. It says, do you think that Hendrix would stoop so low to stop at Zephyr? Zephyr. This is Hendrix and Zephyr. Right. So, nah. that's, that's the hint. So, here it was on the stop sign. Cool. So, that is cool. It was put here in 2017. It was last found um, February 20th of this year. Oh, neat. So, cool. Yep. All right, I'm going to sign our names. We're going to log in. And there you go. And I'll do my outro after a bit. Hang tight, guys. Okay, guys, so there you go. Geocaching for the first time. Um, we had a great time. It was a nice day, 91 degrees hot, but it was a nice day. A couple good finds. Uh, appreciate you guys hanging out with us today and going along with us, huh? Yep. So, I know... Uh, there was um, one of them at the park, that first park we went to, it was put there in 2005. Mm -hmm. So that's going on 16 years now. So, yeah, that's pretty cool that uh, people still doing this. You know, I've heard of it before, but I never looked into it. I didn't know it was this easy or this fun. So. Yeah, it is fun. Yeah. I can't believe how many there are around our area just alone because we're not a big city. No, we're not a big city, but there's 1,500 and some change, like almost 1,600, just in our little town, uh, in and around our little town, so yeah. this is fun. Now, there's a lot. I'm just on the free version of the app. Now, if we get the, if we go premium, if we pay for the app, it's just a few dollars a month. Um, we'll get more places. We'll get better stuff, and we can also... Um, do it offline so like if we get out somewhere where we don't have service it'll gps us and show us so yeah that'll be cool for like when we're camping and stuff yeah that'd be fun because there's a lot around here can't wait to get out west and do this yeah that'll be a blast so anyway guys thanks for watching appreciate it monkey says she's out for now y'all and shea bear the myth man legend gone for now thanks again guys appreciate it we'll see you soon bye bye and take care